Yow! So we got a couple of sheep. Yeah, man, and just going for a quick drive, lock the tractor up. No more reaping today, and probably it doesn't look great for tomorrow either. We had uh, well over 11 mils of rain, probably half an inch of rain. It is quite slippery now. Uh, yeah, was not expecting. Quite warm now, it's going to be hot AF tomorrow, so ah, uh, well, what can you do? I don't know how this will go, but it's pretty warm. It's a lot warmer than I thought. Well, I knew it would be warm, but it seems drier than I thought. I don't know whether we had as much rain right here. Go over the uh, big bin, and look this morning, it's like, ah, uh, she's pretty sticky on top. I don't know how a road train would go there. A warm day to dry the top would be what we want, so better lighting out of it tomorrow. But I uh, see one of the neighbours are going, some aren't, some are. It's going to be 40 plus today, but um, it's not very breezy, so it's actually pretty nice at the moment. So I guess we'll give it a go and see what happens. So I've got a fair bit of work to do anyway. To we've got another bin to reap the calibre in, I was going to reap it into that one, but because of the rain and the fact that we're probably that one alone wasn't going to do it so i've got to need another bin anyway so didn't fancy climbing on top of that one to open that lid when it was raining and thundery and yeah just not a thing anyway that's enough prattling i guess we'll give it a go hey eh? no worries at all moisture's fine there you go but the ground is still pretty damp it's in a couple of places making a few al yeah, it's just light tracks, but uh, yeah. Then they go with a big truck. Maybe okay, maybe not, not sure. Don't really want to take the chance. Pretty solid out here. It's even solid around. Uh, oh, here we go. Nice. Wish we had a thousand acres like this. to help, have we? That's interesting. Working now, and a good sign to pull up, I think. Any bit breezy and hot once we finish this. Well, that was an incredible little crop at five acres. Wish I had a thousand like it. Thought the other was good. Uh, I don't know about the calibre out there, but uh, yeah, I've got a bit of uh, work to do. Like, I've got to clean the... So first, you got to blow down the header, blow out the comb, let the elevators go. Go and empty this box, reap a bit, push it through, then clean the grain tank out. Then reap a little bit more, and then we should be ready to reap caliber seed. So that's what happens when you don't have 100 acres or so to run through of a, of a variety to get the machine clean. But anyway, that's what we have to do, so that's what we will do. Anyway, I think we might pull up, have some lunch and yeah it's hot and windy so i think that might be it for a couple of hours anyway Alrighty, see you later fun reaping the caliber flat on the deck ah oh, it's going all right probably not yielding as well as the other wheats have particularly the ballista but um yeah it's not too bad but uh yeah reaping seeds so uh, uh, just reaping a full box full, just flush everything out, and then uh, clean the clean the box out. We blew the comb off and stone trap and everything else, like everything up front. So now we just got to run a bit through to sort of flush the system out, and then blow the box out as well. Uh, and the uh, grain elevators too. So there's that. Anyway, I'll see you over at the bins, I think. Oh boy, what a job. Anyway, I think we're nearly there. Yeah, almost too much wind, but no, we're getting it done. So I'll reap this caliber seed, and I don't know whether it'll be too late to start out there. Let's see how we go, I suppose. Well, we've got it cleaned up, ready for this seed. Bloody hell. What a job. That was fun. Beautiful. Alright, see you out there. All the fun of reaping something flat on the deck when it's rock leaning away from you. 
and it's just not practical to reap it. I mean, if you had a choice, you'd reap it up and back that way, and then you'd always be lifting it up. But um, because this is the long way in a small paddock, it's just not practical at all. So anyway, that's the fun. But it's doing a good job. It's actually getting it all right. Just not head first like you'd like it. Nothing I can do about it. Anyway, just look at that, just pouring in there. The old fallen over caliber. What a night. What a time to be alive. Post Christmas 22. Beautiful. That's another one. Thank Christ for that. That's it for the seed. Isn't that fun? Alright, I suppose we'll empty this out and go and reap a spot for the bin in the last paddock. The wheat on wheat. That, uh, I don't know whether we'll take any bets on how that one's going to go. It won't. I would be very surprised if it went as well as these have. Uh, even this one's going to be a seven ton for heck there. Um, yeah, seven, seven and a half, and eight and a half, probably. So, yeah. Really good. Well, there it's good. It's very good, actually. Surprisingly good. I mean, it is patchy. There's weed patches and yeah, so overall it won't be as good as the other crops, but it's uh, yeah, quite good so far. Well, we had a quick shower break because it was absolutely disgusting with dust. Ah, uh, so we're back out here doing a little bit. I don't know how, how much longer. There is a spot of rain here and there. It's uh, where it's good. It's good. Real good. I think for wheat on wheat, the old sexy vixen showing its wares. But uh, obviously the wild, oat, the wild oats are bad out here in patches. Uh, we go through one of them and it soon drops it back quite substantially. But Overall, it's um, yeah, better than I thought so far anyway. How long we can go on for, that's another thing. Uh, I think this might be it, it's actually starting to rain. Alrighty, back to the bin. It was good while it lasted. Yeah, real rain now. Maybe not that much, but enough to make it tough. Well, bin's full. Two in the morning. I'm going home. I'm tired. Maybe this is the last night reaping. We'll see, won't we? All right. Night, night, everyone. Mm, delicious. A little bit of a spill. Ah, oh, we got to tidy it up. I think now. So much trouble over such a little thing. Anyway. Looks like we're going back to freewheeling for a bit. The uh, couple of batteries and I don't know what's going on. Anyway. All right, time to get on the move. All right, big fella. Are you ready? No, we're actually out reaping. It's pretty cool, but it seems we've dried out. I got my helpers. Overseers, the bo actual bosses that know what they're doing. So, um, yeah. Wonderful finish today. Yeah, we'd go close, I think, but um, we'll see. Just see how it goes.
fix it. And now my bosses, I think, are asleep. That's solid for weight on weight. Very good. Getting it chewed off. Well, it's actually going pretty well. Much better than I thought it would. On we chew. Hey, don't we? And sleepy. Bella? Ah, uh, well, are we going to stay? Are we going to finish tonight? Or are we going to come back in the morning and maybe fly the drone? I Guess we'll see, eh? Hey? It is getting quite cool though. And I think we might have broken the back of the harvest considering there's only about two boxels left. So there's that too. But no, it's gone very well. Where it's good is really good. And even the uh, wild oat patches weren't as bad as I feared they might be. So for, for wheat on wheat, it's been fantastic actually. Easily the best weed on weed I've ever had. And coming off a strong crop last year as well, that's uh, even more remarkable. There you go. I think I see this had come undone and was jammed up against that. So hence that's why I didn't want to move. Alrighty, I think we found the problem. I don't have a spare one of them. But I think we might be able to get by for a day or so without, I hope. Morning, final morning, I hope. I would have thought so. To be consumed, not a lot. <laughs> About two boxels or probably less. Ah, well, we'll just knock it off, eh? Looks good. That's it. All done. That's another one in the books. So, no, very solid harvest indeed. So, well, the yeah, record breaking harvest, I guess. So, back to back. Now, just got to get the grain away and hopefully not give it away. Uh, We've sold a fair bit, but uh, still a fair bit to be sold, so I guess we'll see how all that goes, won't we? Anyway, I'm going to take this home and come back for the ute and we'll work out. I think they're coming out for a load, so it's all uh, still plenty of the dirt. I think I've got to run to Parafield and get a new electric motor for that uh, auger third wheel. So it'll keep us entertained. Um, that one apparently is cactus. So that's a bit of a shame. Other than that, it's all going pretty well to finish off 2022. 30th of December, by the way. And then there was none. Alright, we're back in business by the looks of it. Look at that. Isn't that good? That's right, fella. Happy New Year, everyone. <laughs>